Hi, my name is Ashish and in this video we will see how to scale and upgrade an AKS cluster. So, so if the resource needs of the application changes and we can manually scale an AKS clusters to run different number of nodes and when we scale down nodes are carefully <coughs> drained to minimize disruption of the running applications. Now as we all know that we have to first of all query the using the is your AKS show command? So let me just go to the portal and take it from there. I'm at the portal, and as we run the command, is AKS show? I think I have it. Is AKS grid credential? So I'm gonna go with show here. Mm -hmm. AKS show then the resource group and then the name of my cluster and then I'm gonna write the query parameter and I'm gonna do the agent pool profiles so this is the my agent pool profile of my current uh, the AKS cluster and if I want to scale it then I will use AZ AKS scale why don't I do this and then I'm gonna un rather than show I'm gonna use scale resource group the name of my AKS Luster, and then I'm gonna use the node pool. I'm gonna use the node count, increase it by one, and node pool, node pool. Uh, name what is the name of my node pool type availability zone scaling the name of my node pool is node pool one here it is one Hit enter Let's see how it goes. <coughs> it's running the command. Let me just pause and come back. Okay, so it worked fine. If you would uh, see the output, it has increased the node here. This is the Docker Bridge CIDR for the containerized networking. And the subnet ID, provisioning state is succeeded, orchestrator version. Name is the node pool one. If you scroll down, Kubernetes version is 1.14.8, and the location is Central India. The maximum agent pools can be go to 10. Resource group is what I created, I'm using it for one. Uh, the port CIDR is this, and this is the service CIDR. Like we have an address space, this is the containerized networking. That we're talking about here after increasing it so this is how you scale the node or scale the AKS cluster and you can use the cluster auto scaler as well which can help you to automatically uh, scale the cluster to meet the application demands on the Azure Kubernetes but that is a different thing altogether and if you would uh, want to upgrade an AKS cluster like we so adding a node count scaling would be to add an, another version for if you want to upgrade it to a different uh, version altogether to a higher prices pain then you would have to check for the available AKS cluster upgrades and uh, now you would check for these and you would 
<laughs> you can use the same command and if you would want to cancel it I'm gonna remove this I'm gonna run a different command altogether so I'm gonna use AZ AKS and I'm gonna do get updates the same thing I'm gonna you know, put it in uh, table get upgrades I'm sorry it's not updates it upgrades Let's see how it goes so let, let me remove it it is not available so this is the uh, version upgrade available so Kubernetes version is 1.14.8 the version that is upgraded is 1.15.7 so this is the version that is upgraded so when we upgrade an AKS cluster Kubernetes minus versions cannot be skipped for example upgrades between 1.12 series to 1.13 or 1.13 to 1.14 are allowed however if you want to upgrade it to directly from 1.12 to 1.14 that is not available so to upgrade from 1.12 series to 1.14 first upgrade from 1.12 to 1.13 then you would be able to upgrade from 1.13 to 1.14 right so i have my current version is 1.14 i cannot directly go to the 1.16 i have to upgrade it to 1.15 right so if i use az aks upgrade command here upgrade it's under this resource group name is this and I'm going to use the Kubernetes version 1.13. I'm going to do it for 1.15.7. Right? I'm going to hit enter. dot k slash k slash minus k okay now we expect okay so it would be one point one five dot seven One point one four. Let's see. The following arguments are required Kubernetes. I'm doing it correctly. Seven. All right, I'm sure you want to perform this operation. I click on Y. Here we go. Since control plane only argument it is not specified, this will do it. All not ports to version this. I'm going to select Y. Yes. So this is not supported. So you got the idea how it gets uh, upgraded. So feel free to uh, come up with questions in the comment section. I see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Bye bye.